The dark continent is something that's been hidden to us for a long time, but what if I told you that the first look at the dark continent, it was going to be something spooky. And you guys can already see from the title, it's self-explanatory. The first time we're going to see the dark continent, we're going to be seeing some things that was never shown to us in the Hunter x Hunter series before. And I'm talking about even for a manga reader. And number one, the number one thing that we want to see ever since hunter x hunter ended was prime netro yes we all want to see what was netro like in his prime and i mean obviously we didn't get to see him go all out but with beyond netro we're going to be seeing netro but beyond of what he was basically obviously because we know that his son he is either going to be equal to or stronger than him yes we know that beyond netro he wanted to go to the dark continent in fact he's the only character who wanted to go to the dark continent so i definitely do think that he is going to be a good representation of what netro was like in his prime if not something spooky you're stronger than that and speaking of somebody possibly stronger than netro jing's true power because yo we've only been revealed to a little bit of his glimpse obviously we do know that he is a master at copying nan and he can basically use any ability but none of those abilities are his which does make jing very spooky the fact that he can master and copy any other ability and use it goes to show you that his main ability it has to be something insane i definitely don't even know what it could be like it might be a transformation it might just be nen i don't even know maybe jing himself is from the dark continent but no in all seriousness we do know that the strongest character yes the new strongest character the fourth prince of kaken he has been revealed we do know that once he does get some experience because we know that he's one of the few characters who has a nen beast and an overpowered nen ability obviously we do know that his nen beast if you tell a lie in front of it that is curtains and he also does have star platinum of the world so i definitely do think that the fourth prince he is definitely one of the strongest characters even though he just learned how to use nen he kind of reminds you of a chimera ant but speaking of the chimera ants the strongest and i definitely do think that these characters they will be the strongest of all because these are going to be s class chimera ants yes we saw that meruem they were only ranked b class and i definitely do think that the s class they're going to be stronger than meruem post the nuke or they might even be on the same level and just imagine a hundred yo that's just a crazy thing a hundred post nuke mariums just running around on the dark continent knowing that we already seen that mariums mom was chased away from the dark continent so it does make perfect sense on how we're going to start seeing more stronger chimera ants than mariums himself and the first look at the dark continent is going to be spooky Comment what you guys see down below. Subscribe if you haven't. Peace out.